we have something on display that nobody else really has. There is no aquarium that you can drive to in Florida or any place else that I know of in this immediate area and go see a giant sea roach or a live hagfish. But here it is in Panacea, Florida, uh, courtesy of Florida State University's Dr. Dean Grubbs, who uh, basically is surveying the northern Gulf of Mexico. He's been able to bring up these giant sea roaches. But this is really the story about the giant sea roach. And I'll tell you how it all really began. It was like 1975 when uh, Nixon Griffiths of the New York Zoological Society came along and he was one of our mentors and helpers and he said, we want to have a big exhibit at the New York Aquarium and what we need is a monster, a cheap monster, but something that people haven't seen before. And I pulled this thing off the shelf and I showed it to him and he said, that's it. So we essentially chartered the boat dredged up these things in the middle of a really nasty winter storm, brought them back, flew them to New York as baggage, brought them to the New York Aquarium, and the whole city went crazy the next day when they were on television, and they were in the New York Times, the Daily News, articles were all over the place, there were interviews, they just made a huge splash, and it just kind of for like two days took the city by storm. As we speak, Japan is going crazy with these sea roaches. There are sea roach statues, sea roach cell phone holders, people wearing sea roach costumes. It's absolutely bizarre. There's even a, a grade Z, Z plus monster movie cartoon of a giant sea roach devouring um, Tokyo. But you could say at this time, Japan's in a fad. They're sea roach crazy. And actually, because it's so popular in Japan, and I am considered the grandfather of the sea roach, which I think is a wonderful title, I would like to go over to Japan and be the ambassador of our sea roaches here in the Gulf of Mexico and create an international fan club for these wonderful animals. If you'd like to find out more information about Gulf Specimen Marine Laboratory and our aquarium tours and the work that we do, please visit our website, golfspecimen.org.